Greetings from Filter Concept. In the previous video, we discussed the various types of inorganic fertilizers and the manufacturing process of ammonium sulfate fertilizers. In this video, we will look at ammonium chloride fertilizers. These are the most popular choice for farmers and commonly used in the agriculture sector. In today's modern world, inorganic fertilizers are essential for healthy agricultural practices. They increase soil fertility and ensure a bountiful harvest. Without inorganic fertilizers, many of the crops we rely on would suffer a drastic drop in yield. This would lead to a shortage of food and a decrease in crop quality. Ammonium chloride is a type of fertilizer used in agriculture to help crops grow. It is made up of two components, ammonium and chloride, and is usually applied to soil to assist crops take up essential nutrients from the soil. Ammonium chloride also improves soil aeration and water retention capacity. The use of ammonium chloride as a fertilizer dates back to the early 1800s when it was first used to increase crop yields in Europe. Since then, its use has grown steadily and it is now used worldwide. Ammonium chloride also improves soil structure and texture, making it easier for roots to penetrate and absorb nutrients. This can lead to better yields and improved crop quality. Additionally, it can provide much-needed water retention capacity, which is extremely valuable in areas suffering from water shortages. Ammonium chloride can reduce the risk of soil erosion, which is a major problem in many parts of the world. By providing a strong base for soil, ammonium chloride prevents soil particles from washing away due to heavy rains or strong winds. Ammonium chloride fertilizers are produced by various methods with the most well-known being the Solvay process. This method involves the conversion of sodium chloride into sodium bicarbonate, with ammonium chloride as a byproduct. The process is fairly simple since it only involves the reaction of ammonia and carbon dioxide with brine solution. The first step involves the reaction of a brine solution with ammonia. For this, the purified brine is fed into the ammonia absorption tower while ammonia gas is pumped into it. The ammonia absorbs into the brine mixture. This mixture is then fed into the carbonation tower where the reaction occurs. Carbon dioxide, mainly sourced through limestone CaCO3, decomposition, is pumped into the tower, which reacts with the ammonia brine solution. This results in the formation of sodium bicarbonate, which precipitated out and soluble ammonium chloride as a byproduct. The next step involves separating these products through filtration. The precipitated sodium bicarbonate is retained in the filter and decomposed to produce sodium carbonate. The aqueous ammonium chloride is further processed for obtaining purified ammonium chloride. For obtaining purified ammonium chloride, the filtered ammonium chloride mixture is processed by heating and separation techniques to remove impurities. Impurities such as ammonium carbonate, sodium chloride and dissolved gases can come out of the mixture. This pure ammonium chloride solution is saturated and fed into a crystallizer. The ammonium chloride crystallizes and is obtained as the product. Another method of manufacturing ammonium chloride is the reaction between ammonia gas and hydrochloric acid. This process is exothermic, meaning it releases heat and produces ammonium chloride in pure form. The process involves the reaction of ammonia gas and hydrochloric acid vapors in a reactor. The resulting ammonium chloride is then typically crystallized, dried, and packaged for use in various industrial and commercial applications. In addition to the above-mentioned methods, there may be additional processes involved in the production of specialized ammonium chloride fertilizers, such as the addition of coatings or slow-release agents to the granules to improve nutrient availability and plant uptake. It should be noted that the manufacturing process for ammonium chloride fertilizers may vary depending on the specific product being produced and the manufacturing facility's equipment and capabilities. However, the basic process outlined above is typical of the industry sector's production of ammonium chloride fertilizers. Ammonium chloride, NH4Cl, is a white crystalline substance used in fertilizers, as a flux for soldering and welding and as a chemical reagent in various industrial applications. Ammonium chloride provides nitrogen for plants. Ammonium chloride contains large amounts of nitrogen, making it an effective crop fertilizer. 
In addition, it improves soil fertility by providing essential micronutrients such as magnesium, calcium, and iron. It is essential to remove the necessary contaminants from the ammonium chloride produced as a byproduct of the solvate process when manufacturing fertilizers. If this is not done, the presence of various harmful substances could have a negative impact on the fertilizer industry and its outcomes. Therefore, it is important to ensure that contaminants are removed to maximize fertilizer industry's effectiveness. At Filter Concept, we are proud to offer tailored solutions for the inorganic fertilizer industry. Our filters are designed to meet the specific needs of this industry, ensuring our products are of the highest quality. We are committed to delivering the best service to our clients, which is made possible by our skilled and experienced team of professionals. We strive to build trust and loyalty through our dedication to top-notch solutions. With our expertise and commitment to excellence, Filter Concept is the premier choice for all your inorganic fertilizer industry needs. For more inquiries, get in touch with us at inquiry at the ratefilter-concept.com or bde3 at the ratefilter-concept.com. Thank you for watching Filter Concept.